I got, I got, I got, I got. Daddy! Father. Sir? Alright, so I'm gonna take this section of the video to, I'm gonna just tell y'all a, a, a few little, little memories about my father. Way, way back, we came actually down here to Florida in like 2002, I don't remember. Y'all was having a hurricane all out in the world for some reason, I don't know. I was like eight, nine maybe. So in the midst of this hurricane, we had never been to Florida before. We get down here all kinds of unprepared. We're at this resort or whatever and everything. We kind of trapped in, we ain't got no food, we wasn't prepared. So my daddy, being the man that he is, Pack everybody up in the car. No store was open, so we're driving trying to find food. So finally, we see a gas station, right? Veer off, sky is gray. It looked like that scene from Legion, like when all of the, like, the little things was coming down. Like, it was just gray and dark, right? So we pull into the, <laughs> pull into the gas station. We're underneath the, the top of the gas station, and the junk is just like rocking like this, just, like, and we're just all like, oh, we gonna die, we gonna die. My daddy run inside and he come back out with oodles and noodles and milk. Another memory, how I learned how to ride a bike. My father, <laughs> being the man that he is, the place that we live is right next to a church. This church has this huge hill, like 90 degree angle. It looked like I had this little bike, this little red huffy bike, right? Like, all right, I'm ready, I'm good. He takes me over there. You know how you see the little videos of parents teaching their kids how to ride bikes, right? And they holding on to it and they let go. That's a that, that's a straight road. That's not that's not what happened here. My daddy just I go 150 miles per hour down this hill, just ha ah, ah, trying to pedal. At one point in time, I just let Jesus take the wheel. Little known fact. That actually worked, and I learned how to ride a bike, and I'm pretty doggone good at it to this day. Thanks. My little brother, uh, he had probably the, one of the most lit parties ever, and it wasn't even a party. We went to go play Airsoft. If y'all don't know what Airsoft is, this is Airsoft. If, if I, I don't know if it's because my family has like a, a, a military background, but that stuff right there, gets us going right there, sir. It gets us going. And so we're out there. I'm not gonna let y'all know how old my daddy is, but this is about three years ago. So he was young, er, than he is now. We're out there just sprinting. We got these guns, we just pow, pow. You don't know, like I said, refer back to that example. And we're out there and it's, it's me, it's my brother, little brother Seth, my little brother Josh, uh, my brother Seth's friend, and my uncle Marlon, my uncle Marlon and my daddy. So it's six of us, right? I guess they thought I was a professional because I came out there prepared. I'm gonna show y'all what it looked like when I was out there. Boom, right? Fly, fly. I was ready to go to Iraq that night. But I'm out there just whacking, whacking, and them jumps hurt. Uh, we went home with holes in our arms. Like, I still have scars. Like, I still have holes in my arm from where I was getting shot. I remember when we got home, my older sister was there, and I got out of the car, and she was like, why are you bleeding? I was like, I got shot. She's like, what? It hurts that bad? I don't want to go. I was like, that's what your mouth said. You need the experience. I'm gonna finish this whole thing off by letting y'all know some of my daddy's favorite sayings. Some of the more YouTube friendly sayings. My daddy had, my daddy has a habit of calling me boy. Like just boy. Like, like he didn't take no part in naming me at all. Just boy. <laughs> my name is Ryan daddy. It's Ryan. Also like, like when he talking to us, like my daddy has, there's five of us. Like we all have the same parents with five kids, right? And I don't know if it's because he gets so caught up that he just don't be remember our names or what it is, but he just be like Ichabuts. Like I'm gonna type it across the screen. Ichabuts. What is a Ichabut? Like I'm gonna need I'm gonna need you yourself, father, to write in the comment section below and explain to all of us what a Ichabut is because I've been trying to figure that out for like 15 years now. Thank you for your contribution. But he also taught me a lot of useful things like, you know, if you do it right the first time, you won't have to do it again. Um, don't have do things. Um, go make the Kool-Aid. 
go make the rice. I thought I told you to take the trash out before I got home, Ryan. Now when I get you, you're gonna think I did you wrong. You know, things like that. It, it wasn't really, you know. But yeah, I appreciate everybody coming through and enjoying this. I'm honestly thinking about restructuring the whole channel, you know, just revamping it all, uh, putting some extra time and effort into it. I mean, I know it looks nice now, but I can do so much better. Sorry that it took so long to make a vlog. Uh, we just been busy, like, with school, with work, you know, with dogs. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And I know a lot of uh, people said that they couldn't subscribe because they don't have YouTube accounts. All you gotta do is use your uh, Gmail and it's the same thing and just go in and make you an account and just help our numbers grow. Once again, I appreciate everybody and thank you. And until next time, deuces.